we are on our way to pick up some tackle <laughs> for this episode. Uh, as you can see in the title, we are going to try and fish with candy. So we're going to a candy store uh, at a mall that's somewhat local to us. It's like the only candy store we could find that I hope has what we need, but kind of just going for everything that mimics like swim baits, you know, worms, etc. So, fish. yeah, so like Swedish fish, big Swedish fish, maybe some uh, licorice sticks or. Licorice sticks? <laughs> licorice. That's what it is. Not licorice. That's what they call them. No, they don't. Yes, they do. You're from Missouri. You don't know anything. It's licorice. It's licorice sticks. That's How why I grew up licorice? calling them as licorice sticks. Please, in what world is it licorice? Have you ever heard them called licorice sticks? Leave a comment below. So, <laughs> licorice sticks, so licorice. Uh, and then gummy worms, obviously. Hopefully they got some giant gummy worms. Maybe a little of those snakes. Remember that one time we found one of those big old snakes? Yeah, but that's a giant bait that I don't know would get eaten. Well, yeah, but still, I can eat it. <laughs> it's true. So, that's what we're going to go do. Let's try and find all this stuff. And then we're going to fish it tomorrow morning. I don't know if it'll work. I kind of uh, thought about this today. I'm a little worried, which, I mean, we're talking gummy things. So, it's already, like, high and bad stuff for you and preservatives but i'm i'm kind of wondering like if the water because it's warm enough will start to like melt the gummy worm so then it's gonna like disintegrate really fast well hopefully like, i don't think we're gonna get very many casts out of them before it disintegrates and like flies out or you know just disintegrates off look as long as i catch one fish off of something it'll make the episode because I kind of thought of this the other day, and I haven't even looked on YouTube to see if anybody else has done it. I'm sure they have, but I do want to try it. I think it'd be fun. So I think it was my idea. We're standing there, and I was looking at the candy, and I was like, hey, jokingly, here's some worms for your tackle. That's right. So yeah, I guess this is her idea. <laughs> so if it fails, then it's on her. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, going to North Lake Mall. Um, not the ideal place to go, but that's where we're going because we live in Mooresville and this mall apparently has a candy store in it. The only one around anymore. Yeah. Apparently candy stores aren't a thing anymore. Who knew? Who knew? Place, this candy store is probably not even going to be there. It's going to be like, dang it. Drove all the way here. Here, 
or this is a giant cola. Yeah, that's like a swim bait. This is more like a swim bait. There's two of them in there. Yeah. That'll work. Wow, this is about to be really expensive, y'all. Just like a wacky worm. Those are kind of tough. Yeah. Get those too. You sure you don't want to play this later? Should we get one of these just in case? <laughs> what are we gonna do with that? Wacky rig. Really throw it up under the This dock. whole thing? Yeah. I don't think so. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Everybody likes candy. Look at that big giant thing. Look at that. It's like a hundred pound bag. <laughs> Four hundred cents. This is about to be a hundred bucks. No, it ain't. I hope not. Oh, golly. <laughs> I'm not even monetized on YouTube yet. Uh, Two. Thank you. Thank you. Dang. That was a lot more than I thought it was going to be. I 100% knew it was going to be that much. Your snake was like eight dollars. We're gonna be fishing for a long time in order to uh, get our money's worth. God, I hope we catch fish. Candy time. We got our pile of candy in the back. We got the boat ready. Now we're going to the lake to try this candy deal out. Uh, we wanted to get on the water at... It's 7.10. Uh, we're 10 minutes behind. That's alright. At least the, the crazies are still sleeping. I do think there is a tournament this morning, but what ifs. To be alright. Leave a comment if it'll work or not. Uncrustables. Some Celsius juices and whatever that is. It's called a spire. Look at that, we're out of here. Some people got up earlier than we did. I'd say. They're probably in the tournament. We're gonna say that. So, yep, I messed up and I left the candy at home. So here comes Hot Rod speeding back down. Yeah, I forgot the candy. My bad. Now we can proceed. Yeah, you can't. You can't candy fish without the candy. Not wrong. Tart ropes. Yeah. And wacky rig Yeah. Unless you want a gummy bear. No. Or the snake. <laughs> That's kind of what I thought I was going to go with. I might start you with a sweet tart rope. The snake? Do you want to start with a snake or a gummy? Kind of funny to. Oh, we did get a 24 inch about. snake. So we have two oh, long perfect. snakes. This stuff here, it just don't work. You got to use this. Dip that yellow into the chartreuse dye. Yeah. I'll do it. You can do that. That chartreuse garlic dye that we have. But here's the extra large ones. Okay. These will be a good move too. Alright. First rig. Sweet tart rope. Unless you're David Dudley, you don't do this. <laughs> Tastes better than a. Yeah, a zoom worm or Gary Yamamoto worm. Oh, it fits perfect too. Look at that. Wacky O'Toole. 
That is funny. So she's rigged on the old white bird. She's fishing with her today. It's pretty good. It's actually really good. Boom. Alright, let's go fish. Alright, first casts. Oh, it just fell apart. Oh. Dang it. Exactly what I thought was happening. Yeah. Do you have it in the water? Yeah, it touched the water for like a second. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> so this has proven to be difficult I like we like we figured considering it's sugar so sugar disintegrates in water or dissolves so therefore especially in warm water yeah so we've lost both of them just by tossing them in the water a couple times. I got mine in there more than you did. This is true. Definitely have lost some. So, watch your face. Re-rig, and then I'm gonna do a... Ew. Did you just eat it? <laughs> Those are gross. I'm gonna put a crocodile on. Perfect. These things are like pretty legit. You don't have a tail. Uh, it's because it's broke off. It fell off. They both did. Bummer. Oh well. Fish, fish fast, fish efficient. There's a whole lot of splashing going there. Right. Right. Right out in front of you. I'm gonna try me a sweet tart rope now. Get the boat stopped moving. Bring it up under there. Want to know why we're not catching any? Because we just sat on one dock for like 15 minutes. Amateurs. I'm not driving the boat. Amateur. Singular. Maybe we shouldn't have got gummy stuff. What were we gonna get? I don't know. Anything's gonna melt. It's all sugary. Maybe we need to try it in, when it's cold outside. So it lasts. Yeah, can I see that wacky tool? Yeah. I think I'm about to do the same as you, just wacky rig. Trying to finesse these dudes through the water. They just come right off. Looks real. Looks like a worm. I'd eat it if I was a fish. Why wouldn't you eat it? It's a gummy. It's pretty good. Orange is good. So, probably pretty Whoa. old candy. It actually went pretty far. So the thought process is... Once it gets wet, basically after your first cast, you don't have X amount of casts left in it. You have a certain time. What that time is, I don't know. Scientific stuff with water and the breakdown of sugar with water but so like if you rig it up and you cast and then you're like oh I don't think I want to cast here anymore well you just lost that essentially because by the time you get to your next spot it's gonna fall off because the water's just eating away in the inside also I think the other thing is like when we're puncturing these like so this one's a good example when you're puncturing this crocodile he has like a coating on him. Oops. He has a coating on him already so that it doesn't stick when it's like with all the others. Mm -hmm. But if you were to like tear this back, it's sticky underneath from the gummy. So I think as soon as we like puncture it and the water starts eating away at that sticky, it's just like inevitable. Like you probably will only get a cast or two out of it. Um, so what you're saying is we just need to not hook the hook through the worm and just through the o-ring itself. Okay. It's not very good. I wouldn't think they are. Crocodiles, not. Mm -mm. 
So we're gonna beat this bank up. Lots of structure, rocks, lay downs. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> it's like creamy lime. That sounds awful. Just look at that carbon on that jack. Ooh. And the crocodile. Alright, beat it up. Alright. So, you see this tree coming into the water? Just toss it straight down onto it. He's sitting up on it. Pretty sure I just lost mine as soon as I threw it. Yep. Dang it. It's on you, doll. He's under that tree. He bit the sour worm. So, oh, <laughs> on the back cast. Oh, no! What just happened? Had it. Oh! <gasps> it was pulling dragon out. That's what literally. Philip looking cool coming in here. Comes Philip. He doesn't believe that this is gonna work. So far, he's right. He voted no on Instagram. All right, I'm looking at a bass right here in front of me. Pull him back out, put him up in there. Come on, it's candy. It's good. Pudgy and pal. Yeah. So, so far your Instagram vote is right. What's that? Ain't caught nothing yet. <laughs> I just hooked up on one and lost it. Yeah. But yeah. Pudgy? Uncrustable. Meat clear and jelly? Yeah. My alarm went off. Which one? The third alarm. <laughs>
So instead of bass, I'm just going to fish for something because I want to catch a fish. It all falls apart way too easy, way too quick. She was right about the whole sugar thing. So I don't want to get skunked. So I came back to one of my favorite hunting spots that I never hunt because it gets hunted a lot. I'm going to fish for a little bit while we're waiting on some buds to meet us up here to go to supper. Hopefully I can catch some. What you got there? Fish stick. A fish stick. It's a pretty big one. It's more like a fish tender. Wow. A pine cone. And a pair of pine cones. really excited because I was actually recording. That was just a melted bag of centipedes. That? Yeah. Just one tank, yummy. Yeah. Just one dollar for you to hold that. Give you a dollar for you to hold that. Not right now. Bar and grill. Sounds like they got a pretty, pretty jamming band back there. So, Alex and Ryan are over there. We're going to tie up and we're going to eat us some food. So, see y'all next time. Like, comment, subscribe.